In today's video, I'll show you how to install Ubuntu 24.04 on your system without using a USB flash drive. This method is perfect if you don't have a spare USB stick. We'll be using a clever workaround that utilizes your hard drive partition to get the job done. So let's get started. First, head over to the official Ubuntu website and download the latest Ubuntu desktop ISO file. Once you have got the ISO file downloaded, let's move on to the next step. Now we need to create a new partition on your hard drive. So open disk management. Right click on the drive with enough free space and select shrink volume. Shrink it by 8 GB for the Ubuntu ISO. Right click on the unallocated space. Select new simple volume. Make sure to format it in the FAT32 file system. So we created a new partition. We'll be using this partition just like a USB drive. Next, download the universal USB installer tool. You have to download this specific version for it to work correctly. I have linked it in the video description below. This tool is usually used to create bootable USB drives, but we'll be using it in a slightly different way. After downloading, run the application. Select Ubuntu from the distribution dropdown. Browse and select the Ubuntu ISO file you downloaded earlier. Check this box to show all the drives. Then choose the 8GB partition you created as the USB drive. Click create. This will prepare your partition to act like a bootable USB drive. Finally, restart your computer and repeatedly press the boot menu key usually F2, F10 or F12 depending on your PC. In the boot menu, select the partition we just created. It's named UEFI OS in my system. You should now see the Jira bootloader screen. Select try or install Ubuntu. Now the Ubuntu installer screen appears. Just follow the on-screen instructions to install Ubuntu on your computer. If you want to dual boot Ubuntu and Windows, select install Ubuntu alongside Windows. And if you want to replace Windows, select erase disk and install Ubuntu. I am going to select the first option. From this screen, you can select how much space you want to allocate for the Ubuntu system. I will allocate around 100 GB. And that's it, you have successfully installed Ubuntu alongside your existing Windows operating system without needing a USB drive.